Ooh, just came from the the gym. Today is September. What's today? September twenty first. Oh, let's put it this way. September twenty first. Yeah. Just came from the gym. I did uh, back today. Um, I sort of record a little bit of some of my. Uh, uh, I think this morning before I. Uh, you know take the kids to school I record uh, what I was going to eat I believe I only showed the uh, coffee and as I was packing my cookies actually the cookies was already packed since yesterday and I sort of showed you guys what I'm gonna eat afterward and I put I believe six of those cookies um, I wanted to eat only four so and I took one out to eat later on before I step out. At the time, I believe it was like seven o'clock when I when I record the first little video. Um, so the coffee will be good for like uh, maybe an hour because my the uh, yeah about an hour. And then as I step out of the door with the kids, uh, I will take one of the cookies with peanut butter. I didn't record that. Um, so I took one of the cookies before I took my son to school and uh, I ate it with peanut butter and uh, put the rest in my bag and uh, after workout I ate four of it on my way you know I was eating in the street and you know I ate four of it I almost I was full actually um, but I needed to replenish uh, whatever I just you know messed up at the gym and uh, I was about to eat one more and I was like I'm full I don't want to eat one more and I realized that uh, I already ate four so um, this is the last one so yeah that was my plan anyway uh, six cookies were in the bag one before I step out and four after workout and uh, if I was really hungry then I would eat one more um, but I was already full I didn't eat the last one so I'm gonna save it put it in the fridge for manana so anyway I went last night I got up I think it was around maybe two o'clock and I couldn't sleep so I turn on I turn on the TV um, was watching YouTube and whatever and uh, on the side of my uh, my head I saw something cool I was like, I never have any uh, insects and stuff in the house. And I, you know, I didn't turn on the light. I used my phone to look around to see if I see something. And I was like, okay, maybe it's just in my head. So I left it alone. But at the same time, I'm still looking. I'm like, geez, I hope there's no rat in the house. Or mice, whatever it might be. But the thing just flew by on the side of, you know, on my eyes, I saw it. I was watching TV, but I saw it pass by. And... I'll say maybe five, six, ten minutes later, I was still watching TV and I saw it crawl back under the bed. I was like, what the fuck? I said out loud, actually, my husband was sleeping and I woke him up. And he was like, what happened? What happened? I was like, I just saw something, you know, pass, you know, crawl under the bed. I don't know why it is. I wake up that poor guy so we started looking and stuff like that so I said okay after I work out I'm gonna go to the store and buy a mouse trap I don't want those that kill the thing or if it's a mouse I don't know what it is because we never have this problem uh, so I went to the store to buy just mouse trap And I think I have some uh, footage of that. So I went and I bought a waterproof shower cap. There's the mousetrap. 
the I bought the glow one. Um, it was what one twenty nine. So I bought one. There's four of it in it, and uh, I bought gloves. So when I'm washing the you know cleaning the bathroom, and I bought disinfectant things you know to make the house smell good and the bath is mostly for the bathroom um i was looking for citrus kind of smell but i didn't find any and i took the green one and hoping that uh it smells like citrus if it smells like flower or any other kind of smell everybody's gonna have headache in the house and uh and i remember that uh we ran out of uh soap to wash, uh, you know, for my kids to wash their hands once they come in the house. If they're coming from outside, I, you know, it's a habit I give them to wash their hands. So we ran out of soap a long time ago, and I forgot. And all of a sudden today, you know, I guess I was in the right aisle to see the thing, and I went and buy it. So I bought four stuff. It's the 99 cent store. Uh, uh, I spent what six dollars and sixteen cents, so it wasn't that much. So, and while I was there, um, I saw them selling those. Uh, uh, how do they call them? Those things to put money in. Let's say if you're gonna bring it to the bank, instead of uh, give the bank the 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 coins. Um, you know loosely so they have those little package to put them I have a footage of it and I saw them selling it and I think I'm gonna create a video about it uh, I don't know which channel I'm gonna put it but sometimes people needs to know oh I need to oh yeah I did stop it um I was talking about my watch because I stopped working out I forgot I already turned it off I wanted to turn it off I didn't want it to continue running so um I'm going to create a video about it. To, sometimes people don't know things. And a simple video might help so many people. Um, those things, you don't need to buy them. You go to, uh, If you go to the bank and ask them for those things, they give it to you free. I've done it so many times. Uh, you know, there are times, you know, when we come in, we have loose chains. We put it in a little container. And one time we were running out you know it, it was getting filled up so we wanted to get out the house we went to the bank and asked for those things and they gave me a couple of them um if for instance i find out that uh, they, i need more or they won't give me again although i never had that problem i will go and and ask for it and then i'll ask my husband to go and ask so you know lately people need to save money so anything that could help people to save money yeah, so I'm probably going to put that on the other, uh, create a video about it. It may sound silly, but it might help a lot of people. That dollar twenty nine, I, I don't know how much it was at the store. That dollar twenty nine can be put in that little, cut, those things, and put it in the bank. Instead of spending to buy it, to put it in there. So, yeah, that's that. And, oh, by the way, I did, my workout today was pretty good. Um, at the beginning... There were a lot of people. Um, I was a bit afraid to record. Um, and then I did the first set. Uh, still, there were a lot of people around me. Um, I, nobody ever said anything to me. Uh, although when I record, um, I do not... Uh, uh, how will I say that? Uh, I don't record when there's a lot of people. So no one have never actually come to come up to me and tell me stop recording because I, ne I never really record when there's a lot of people around but so i take my precaution so i did I, today i was doing back and i sort of mentioned it before i step out uh, this morning on that little video that i did so i uh did back the first set like i said there were a lot of people so i didn't record um and I was like, because yeah. I wasn't planning on doing three sets, only two sets. Because the way that I do it, it's one after another. So it's, it's enough for me. I don't really need to uh, go crazy, do quadruple set, unless if I have a goal. Right now, I'm just maintaining. Um, so in my mind, I wanted to do just two sets of uh, the circuit for the back workout that I was going to do. So um, when I realized, oh man, uh, there's still a lot of people, 
am I gonna record or stuff like that so I said F it let me just pull the camera out and just uh, you know start recording because I took a long break before I start my next uh, uh, set so by the time uh, I went I went in the in the locker room they have a container thing for people to drink water they put the uh, uh, ice bucket with uh, lemon in it so I went in there I took the cup to get uh, some water I forgot to bring my water so I went in there to get water so when I came back the area that I was working out was empty I was like even though I was still my heart rate was still up so I was like, let me get the camera out and let me start recording and do the next set and get it out of the way. So I did the second set. Um, I only record just one set, like I'm saying. So right after I finished that and um, my area was still empty, even though I wasn't going to do arms, triceps, right after I was going to go to the lat pull down and then come back to that area to do tricep, you know, to give those uh, muscles a little break. And I said, you know what, the area is empty, let me just do it and pull the camera out again and did one set, only one set of the tricep um, workout. And then after that, I went and uh, did the lat pull down. And that area was empty also, so I pulled the camera out and I recorded. So I was pretty happy about it that uh, I was able to record because there were a lot of people. So if there are a lot of people, when I look at the footage again, you know, I'll just cut uh, where they are or black their faces, uh, things like that. I hate doing, you know, blacking people's face. Uh, not only my, the computer I don't know if it's slow if it's the machine or if it's the program it, it, I just don't want it to be too much and it takes too much time so when I get a chance I'm gonna record it um uh, not record I'm gonna put it together and um, put it um, upload it and I think I'm gonna call this the back this back workout my I had I was thinking about it while I was in the gym my back uh, cardio yeah my back cardio because it's pretty much like a cardio uh, kind of thing because I'm going from one uh, state one workout after another with minimum uh, rest in between so that's it